this makes everyone think of sex because it smells so yeah. attractive yes. and amazing. Hi, welcome to Rot the Rebel. I'm here with the one and only Sunder Solomon Fragrance. Hi, everyone. Today we are going to do something really exciting. We are going to talk about 13 fragrances for men with extremely high sex yes. appeal. Yes, so I will be honest with you guys. Sex appeal is much, much more than just fragrance. It's your charisma, it's how you come across, it's the smile on your face, it's how you behave and all that, right? Yes. But with that said, these fragrances are sexually loaded, so they will help. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Let's do this. Yes. So please, show them the first one. Yes, the first one with high, extremely high Oof. sex appeal yes. is... Oh, Guerlain's L'Omédial Extreme. Oh my God. Please spray it on. I'm going to yes. quickly read up the notes. We have almond, pink pepper, bergamot, plum. Oh my God. Cinnamon, heliotrope, tobacco, leather, patchouli, and cedar. This one. You said plum. Mm. You said leather. Mm. Oh my God. And I got away from it. It's this so is good. So, yeah. I know there's no booze in this, but this is like boozy almonds. Yeah. The most delicious almond dessert yeah. and extremely sexy. This one has that almond that I keep on preaching about. That intoxicating signature Lom Ideal almond, but in a sort of a more fruity blend yeah. together with that hint of leather and it's just and the fruity side, the plum and all. Yeah. It's intoxicating, it's super sexy. And this one definitely has high sex appeal. Do you have anything to add to this amazing blend? Uh, yes, I do, because mm -hmm. all of the Long Ideal fragrances are extremely, yes. they are sensual, they are attractive, they yes. are elegant, but this one is what I think may be the one with the highest sex yeah. appeal. And every time I smell this, I picture a really, really attractive, mm -hmm. sexy and wonderful man Oof. in some kind of bar. In, in some kind of bar. Yeah, I think it's mm. the boozy side. So what about restaurants? Yeah, that's okay too, but this guy hangs in the bar. Okay. Flirts okay. from a distance. So the next one up with extremely high mm. sex appeal. Extremely high. the one from Paco Rabanne, the Pau collection, mm. and it is called Fuck Me. Whoa. No, no, it's, I'm sorry. Yeah. No, cut, you have to cut yeah, that out. Yeah, dandy me. Yeah, dandy me. Behave. <laughs> You're scaring them away. <laughs> okay, so please do spray it on and I'm gonna read up the notes. We have cinnamon, saffron, grapefruit, may rose, geranium, agarwood, sandalwood and vanilla. But this one to me is really focused on that grapefruit yeah. with the rose and the yes. geranium and then the sandalwood and the vanilla. Yes. So like a woody floral, a sweet woody floral. And it's intoxicating. I had so many compliments and some pretty out, outrageous one, uh, ones while I've been dating with this one. I love it and I do yeah. know that you think this is crazy sexy. This is amazing yeah. and may I add, it's about that grapefruit, it's about the sandalwood and it is creamy sweet in yes. a beautiful way. Yes. So yeah, we talked about this one so much. I don't have anything to add except that this one is crazy sexy. Yeah. It has an insanely high sex appeal. I'm gonna link to my review of it above, so please do check that one out. So next up, we have one of my favorites, probably the most favorite in the entire Stronger With You collection from Armani. This is Stronger With You, absolutely. Yes. Oh my God. And they could have just named this Sexier With You, absolutely, because yeah. that's... Or Absolutely Sexy. Yeah, yeah. Or Something just like that. Absolute Sex or... Absolute yeah. Sex, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Outrageous again, are you? Please just spray it on and I'm gonna quickly read out the note. We have rum, elemi, bergamot, lavender, davana, chestnut, Madagascar, vanilla, cedar and patchouli. This one to me is wow. incredibly smooth. It has something slightly, I'm, not, I'm gonna say smoky, but it's was, not smoky. I was just thinking smoky. So smoky, yes. but not smoky. That boozy sort of <laughs> a side say, to it. Did you just say it has something smoky, but not smoky? Yes, I did. Yeah. Okay, uh, now I know. Then the chestnut, vanilla, the cedar, and it has that strong with you kind of scent in it, yeah. but in an insanely intoxicating, yeah. sexy and attractive blend. This is deeper, it's thicker, it's yeah. darker, it's so 
good. Yes. I love it. I'm going to link to my review of Stronger With You absolutely above. So make sure you check that one out. And the next one is Savage Elixir from Dior. This one went up to quickly become one of my most complimented fragrances of 2021. Yeah. I absolutely adore this one. So we have cinnamon, nutmeg, cardamom, grapefruit. Then we have lavender, licorice, sandalwood, amber, patchouli, and Haitian vetiver. This one to me is really focused on that lavender balm together with the licorice, yes. the sandalwood, and a bit of vetiver at the base. Yes, and the cardamom. It's, yeah, it's yeah. insanely unique. It's an insane uh, compliment getter. It's definitely an insanely awesome attention grabber. People will notice you when you have this one on. And to yeah. me, and I know for you as well, it has an insanely high sex appeal. And without a doubt, it's the best in the Sauvage line yes, to me. Yes, absolutely. Make sure if you have not yet put your nose to this one, go and do so. It's insanely sexy. So next up, we are moving to the house of Jean-Paul Gaultier. Jean-Paul Gaultier fragrances are usually happy, playful, sexy and flirty. And this one is no exception. This is Jean-Paul Gaultier Ultra Male. Please do spray it on. Yes, please let me. We have pear, lavender, mint, bergamot, lemon, cinnamon, caraway, clary sage, black vanilla, husk, amber, patchouli, and cedar. But this one to, to me is really focused on that super bomb of that super sexy pear with the vanilla and a bit yeah. of mint to it. It's so good. This is like tasty pear ice cream on a wonderful aromatic bed. And mm. it's extremely sexy. Yes. And yes. it works for every occasion yes and yes. no matter if you're like in the most not sexual situation you will smell you sexy. will smell like a sex bomb with this one on yes a, right a sexy pear bomb okay yeah a sexy pear <laughs> bomb. yeah so basically in a nutshell this one is really focused on that pear with the vanilla it's loud it projects like crazy and most women absolutely love it. Yeah. Most women find it extremely sexy. You will get noticed with this one on. Do you have anything to add to this no, amazing this one? this is perfection. The next up is the one, mm. the only mm. tobacco fragrance you're ever going to need with an extremely high sex appeal. Yes. And that is Herod from oh, Parfums de oh Mali. Oh my, please do spray it on. I'm going So we to. have cinnamon, pepper, tobacco leaf, incense, osmanthus, labdanum, vanilla, iso e, super, musk, cedar, cypria oil, and vetiver. Yeah. Vanilla, uh, tobacco, every single time, cinnamon, yeah. wow. Yeah. Every single time I get a whiff of it, I'm reminded of how insanely sexy and amazing yes. this one is. And it's extremely sexy, but to me it's also very classy and elegant, so this is very elegant sexy it's not like dirty sexy a classy scent with an extremely high sex appeal would you yes, agree yes next up is ysl y edp so good and this is so good yeah um i like all of the y fragrances yeah. but this one actually stands out yeah and the high sex appeal is so obvious in this. yeah so we have apple <laughs> ginger bergamot sage juniper berries geranium amberwood tonka bean cedar vetiver and olibanum yeah. what i really enjoy about this one is that it has a sort of a fresh side to it it has a bright side but it has the mids as well yeah. it has a depth as well yeah. there's something sweet to it it's aromatic and it's absolutely stunning yeah. this one this is another one that quickly went on to become one of my top compliment guys it almost always works yeah, if you want almost guaranteed a compliment and sort of a slightly dirty and sort of erotic, or maybe not erotic, but sexy <laughs> look, then this is the one to go for. I absolutely love this one. Try this one. Ah, okay. You will probably love it. This to me is definitely one of the best in the YSLY collection. Yes. And I think without a doubt that it's absolutely one of the most sexy ones in that collection. Yes. If you have not yet tried this one, please do so. So next up we have one that I call the Sex machine. <laughs> yeah, sex bomb. bomb. This is the sex bomb to me. Please do spray it on. Oh, I forgot to name say what it is. Yeah. This is Valentina Uomo Intense. We talked so much about this yes. one and why? Because it's insanely sexy. It is spray insanely it sexy. And I'm gonna tell you how sexy this is. Mm. You can be in the mall. No in the food store mm -hmm. where you buy your groceries mm -hmm. and that is not a sexy situation no. i mean there's packages and yeah just boring yeah. and lots of people and stuff 
But when someone gets a whiff of yes. this in that kind of store, you drive people crazy. Yes. This makes everyone think of sex because it smells so yeah. attractive yes. and amazing. So this one is interesting because you mentioned like a grocery store, right? Yeah. With this one, I actually had reactions in the supermarket. I had re reactions in the subway, in the gym, in the club, pretty much everywhere. This one captures people's attention. And when it does, people usually think it's incredibly sexy. Yes, and uh, may I just ask where in the food store is the perfect place to flirt? Mm. <laughs> is it like by the yeah. toilet paper or is it by the mm. milk or no. the fruits, I, I, the sexy I, raspberries? I don't think I would put in a move like that by the toilet paper, no. Uh, but I, I, now when I think about it, the few times, this is not something that happen, happens every time, but the few times it has happened, it's usually like by the fruits. Like where? Maybe by the bananas, I don't know. <laughs> so I can't remember all <laughs> the details. Bananas? <laughs> Which bananas? Did you say that? <laughs> so I, I realized I forgot the notes. We have mandarin yeah. orange, uh, clary sage, iris, tonka bean, vanilla and leather. This one is super powdery. It's really focused on the iris, the tonka bean, the vanilla, and the leather. And it's so damn good. Both you and I, I love it. Both yeah. you and I think it's an insane compliment getter with an insane high sex appeal. Just get it, guys. Get it. Next up is the sweet sex bomb. And that is the one I always get wrong. So I'm hoping I'm going to get it right now. The most wanted from Azaro. Correct. Did I say right? That was right. Oh my God. So, Can you please read the notes? Are you ready for all the notes? We have yes. cardamom, toffee, and amberwood. That's it. And that's all you need to have a really sexy yeah. fragrance because yeah. that sexy sweet caramel is something that I think almost every woman enjoy. On a yeah. It, it just can't get better when you have some spices and you have some. Oh, yeah. The sweet caramel. So I think this is an incredible one. You can wear it to any situation and you will bring the sex appeal. You can wear it to work, but I would say definitely wear this to a date. Mm. I would love to smell this on a man on a date. It's just the perfect dating fragrance. It's elegant, it's inviting, it's very sexy, but still like classy. I agree. And that is the perfect combination. Yes, yes. I love this one so much. This is yet another one that I received a ton of compliments for. Make sure you try Azara Most Wanted. Next up, we have one that I feel is criminally underrated. This is the insanely sexy Paco Rabanne Excess Night. Please do spray it on. And I'm yes. quickly gonna read out now. We have ginger, juju. Juju, we have, we have juju. We have juju is good. Yeah, juju is good. We have ginseng, we have ginger, cacao, vanilla, cinnamon, caramel, and myrrh. This one to me is warm, it's spicy. There's something, I know it's not super powdery or anything, no. but especially when it dries down, I get a slight hint of something that feels powdery. I don't know what it is, but the best part of this one is that dry down. Yeah. That dry down blew me away the first time I got a whiff of it and oh my god, women find this one so damn sexy. And yeah, actually this had skipped my radar completely mm. until you got it and opened my eyes for it. I love this one, mm. just as you say the powdery, spicy, and to me also fruity dry down mm. is incredibly sexy. So next one is one of my latest additions to my collection. And this one has quickly gone up to become one of my most compliment ones. And is definitely currently one of my absolute sexiest ones. Please do show it to him. Yes, Major Me. Major Me. This is part of the Park Collection from Paco Rabanne. I'm quickly going to read up the notes. We have, and the notes are amazing, yeah. cherry, pepper, patchouli, agarwood, incense, moss, and benzoin. I have a review of this one coming up, so make sure you stay tuned for that one. But this one to me really is that pepper in the beginning to get together with the cherry, yeah. and then that oud together with the incense. The incense is done the right way. Yeah. It's the kind of incense that both you and I, yeah. I like. And it's a sort of a modern, mass appealing kind of incense. And the same goes for the oud. This is not a funky oud or anything. No. It's incredibly mass appealing. But the fusion between the cherry, the incense and the oud, yeah. so 
damn sexy. I find it extremely sexy and I do know that you agree with me. Yeah. And you have firsthand witnessed the sexy powers of this juice. So Sandra Samofregus and I went on vacation in Thailand and we went out a few times and enjoyed ourselves. And this one pulled in the compliments like crazy, yeah. especially one night. That was crazy. That was crazy. And I can really understand why, because this is some one of the most sexy fragrance I have smelled this year. Mm. This smells niche. Yeah, and as you definitely. said, the combination of the cherry, the oud and the incense, it's just, it's truly unique and it's incredibly sexy. Yes. And this turns heads. Yes, so all I'm gonna say is this. If you want an amazing blend of cherry, incense and oud, the whole blend is really mass appealing, but to me really, really unique with an insanely high sex appeal. Yeah. Make sure you try to get your nose on this one. And the next one up is one that I don't smell on people so often. No. And that is too bad because this has a really high yes. sex appeal and it do yes. make you smell quite unique. It's Chopard Black Incense oh Malachi. Oh my god. I'm Please so do spray happy it on. on this one. So we have leather, resin, smoke, agar wood, woody spices, wood, no, sorry, woody notes, spices, <laughs> spices. and olibanum. This one to me is focused on that sort of incense smoky scent, yeah. together with leather, together with something woody, something a bit sort of spicy, and something slightly sweet. Yes. It's definitely unique. This one to me is like incense done right. It is. Uh, and it's just crazy good in a crazy unique way and in a crazy sexy way. Yeah, and I, what I really enjoy with this one is that this is a leather fragrance that is kind of different from yes. other kinds of leather fragrances. Yeah. This is elegant and like a sweet leather. Yes. And it's not so often I come across a sweet leather no. because often it's just leather, yeah. raw leather. Yeah. But this is sweet and elegant leather and yeah. I just love this. Perfect for dressed up occasions. I agree. So if you are a subscriber, which you are right, come on, hit that subscribe right now and that notification bell, then you know that I'm a leather freak. Now I have a ton of leather fragrances. This one is a bit different to some of the usual ones that I usually talk about. Yeah. This is Gucci Guilty Absolute. It's a bit polarizing to some people, but it's definitely insanely sexy. Yeah, it is. So it's polarizing, but remember guys, polarizing can be a good thing. Polarizing yes. means you usually trigger a reaction and that reaction can lead up to something else, like a compliment. Yeah. like a conversation or yeah. something like that. So we have leather, cypress, patchouli, woody notes and vetiver. This one really to me is focused, it's quite a linear kind of scent. So it stays the same, which I think is amazing. Yeah. It stays the same from the start to the, uh, start to the beginning, from the beginning <laughs> to the end. But it's really focused, at least to me, on that leather together with the vetiver. Yeah, every time you have that on, I'm like, wow, you have it on. Yeah, yes, yeah. she goes absolutely <laughs> nuts whenever I put it on. So yeah. yeah, Gucci Guilty Absolute, it's an attention grabber leather fragrance with extremely high sex appeal. So I wanna know if you have tried any of these fragrances, please put it in a comment how you feel about them. And I would love, love, love to know which is the fragrance that you have had the most or just someone tell you that it's extremely sexy. Which is that fragrance? Please put it in a comment. Please do drop a like on this video. Thank you, I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to head on over to Sandra Salomon Fragrance channel. Sub to Please her, do. sub to me, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.